What's up drama divas and drama dudes? Welcome back to Christina's Drama. So yesterday news broke that Khloe Kardashian was on her way to the gym and Lamar Odom ambushed her. So basically he was trying to touch her and she was yelling at him to get off and I don't know, it was just some kind of big drama. So today, Lamar Odom was cornered by TMZ and he spoke out against the Kardashians and Chloe. Nobody got followed, nobody got hassled, nobody got harassed, nobody got grabbed on. Probably what's the most hurtful part is that I beat, I beat it to the punch. I didn't want to come up here. Somebody should be calling up here saying, hell no, that didn't happen. Y'all won, y'all beat me down, no, I degraded me, said I would do everything in the world. I'm a womanizer, a drug addict, everything. Listen. I probably couldn't even get hired by Home Depot right now. If it happens again, I will air everything out. So it's a running joke in the media that um, when you get with the Kardashians, they can either make you or break you. And in the case of Chris Humphreys and Kim Kardashian, I remember reading that um, in the show Keeping Up With The Kardashians, they made Chris to look like he was basically a bad dude because I remember watching it and thinking I'm so glad that they got divorced because Kim can just do so much better Chris isn't a good guy but apparently they manipulated it to make him look bad so people are saying that basically because of this whole no Kardashians for a week what they did is they told Lamar that Chloe was going to be there and then they had this big drama so that they can get back into the um, into the media, into the gossip columns. So Lamar saying that he wants to expose secrets and we all know that the Kardashians have secrets. What I hate is when people say that they're going to expose tea. If you've got the tea, expose it. I, I don't want to speculate about it. If Lamar has something to say, he should just say it because he's right. They have called him a crack addict. They have called him a womanizer. So um, he's never really spoken out about that. So we've kind of just assumed it to be true because Chloe's always said that she really still loves him, Lamar. So we kind of think, so we, we kind of been made to think that the reason why they're not together is because Lamar's a drug addict. And of course he had two friends who tragically passed away from um, drug drug issues so I really want to see what Lamar has to say and I want to see if um if this whole thing was really a setup so guys let me know what you think about Lamar Odom threatening to expose the Kardashian secrets let me know in the comment section like this video and subscribe to my channel because I do hot topics every single week and I will see you soon drama divas and dudes